Hi Capricorn, welcome back to Om Kara Taro and to another Love Bite. Capricorn, let's see what's the message here for you today. And uh, a warm welcome back to all my subscribers and welcome in newcomers. Capricorn Spirit, what's the message for my Capricorn gang today? Chariot in reverse, Eight of Swords in reverse, Two of Cups upright nice seven of wands ace of cups oh there's a lot of love here but somebody's feeling blocked this person does want to try again but they're feeling blocked right now very depressed very sad because they don't know maybe how to ask for it or whether their offer will be accepted okay so let's um, Let's do your dialogue message cards first, Capricorn. Let's see if you guys could say something to each other, what that would be, and then we'll clarify the rest. Capricorn and that person's spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Capricorn and that person. Okay, just a few more Capricorn from another deck. Capricorn and that person's spirit, if they could say something to each other now what would that be and just a few more capricorn from a third deck as well capricorn and that person capricorn and that person spirit capricorn and that person all right good to go capricorn let's start the reading and if any of you are looking for personal readings, my email is omkarataro at gmail.com. You can reach me there. It's there in the description box below as well. So the first card says, All those secrets I kept caught up with me, each and every last one of them. I wish I could have been emotionally available and let you in. Let me just adjust the camera. Yeah. I wasn't ready for what you were offering. I must admit that I'm longing for your touch and your warm embrace. I'm willing to offer an olive branch to you if I'm able to communicate with you. I would gladly accept an olive branch from you. I long for peace and I miss you. This is not the way I wanted things to end. I wish I could go back in time. I listened to the wrong people. They were wrong about you. I wish I could have loved you the way you deserved to be loved. I don't expect you to be perfect. I love your perfect imperfections because they make my life as perfect as one can imagine. I kick myself for sabotaging this relationship. My life won't be the same. My desire is to have a family with you. Will you have a family with me? Not talking to you absolutely breaks my heart and soul into a billion shattered pieces. I want to reach out to you, but I can't find the right words as I'm feeling so fragile right now. I want us to be able to talk through things properly. The only problem is in your presence. All I seem to have wild thoughts about what I want to do to you. Why do you try and why do you feel it necessary to try and label me? I'm far more than any label could ever describe, and so is our connection. All right. So these were some of your messages, uh, Capricorn. If these were resonating with your storyline, let's start the reading. But first, an angel blessing card for you. Let's see what my angels are going to bless my Capricorn with today. Blessing, guidance, advice or a message. And the card I have here for you Capricorn is sleep. Maybe somebody needs a little to come out of their head I think. There's a lot of overstressing, overanalyzing, overthinking and if they can you know just kind of get a good night's sleep I guess they would realize that there is love here. A lot of love here between the two of you. So maybe this connection has gone into sleep mode I don't know. Let's see. I'm going to clarify these cards. But first, let's take, okay, I've done that. Now we have to clarify the cards, right? Okay, Spirit, tell me, why is the chariot in reverse? Why is the chariot? Yeah, somebody is stuck. 
they don't they they don't know how to take action or um, whether they can get unblocked now. This person is stuck. They are trying to figure things out. I guess maybe manifesting that they can. Maybe uh, there is a lot of love. I'm feeling that surge of love in my heart, but. It's coming from a place of fear. It's like fear of expressing myself. How do I tell my person that maybe, I don't know, there's a lot of frustrated er energy because in the past, maybe you guys have had an argument or a fight regarding the connection. Maybe they're scared that the love is lost now. So eight of swords in reverse, eight of swords in reverse. This person is really hoping to come out of their head. I think spirits wants them to just take a good nap, clear their head, but because that's what they want. They they don't want this chapter to shut down. They are recognizing that this is a this is a perfect partnership. Two of Cups. What's the Two of Cups? Two of Cups. Yeah, this person is uh, kind of trying to figure out they're at crossroads right now. They don't know whether the other person feels the same love for them or not. They feel it. They feel it. They are now wondering whether the other person feels it because they, I think there's silence regarding that topic between the two of you. They don't know whether the other person still feels that close connection with them anymore. There's a lot of regret. There's a lot of sadness. There's a lot of looking at the past and feeling terrible, feeling uh, really down and out. Maybe uh, why, why, why did I do what I did? Why did I block this connection out? Uh, seven of uh, wands what's the seven of wands spirit yeah they're not happy at all they want to fix things they want to fix things they they want to try again they don't want to have a missed opportunity or that feeling that i'll never have that long-term happiness again i think somebody really wants to offer their cup of love now uh, so what is that spirit ace of cups ace of cups Yep, they want a second chance. They want a second chance. They want to offer their cup of love. They want to clear the air. They want a second chance. But somewhere, I think there's a bit of fear that the other person is very resistant or blocking them. They feel that the other person will never trust them again or is angry and upset with them will uh, turn down their offer even if they were say even if they took action and said you know I'm ready now or something uh, uh, they are insecure about the fact that this time round that person will not trust them or will block them or be defensive and say no to that offer uh, yeah they're not sure whether whether their offer will be accepted they feel that person is not even missing them anymore and doesn't want to reconcile with them. Why? Because of all the bad memories created. Whoever this individual is who is wanting this love now but not being able to express it, they have kind of lost hope. The feeling that they lost out on their biggest wish because they are seeing that person out there really happy. Single, abundant, beautiful, maybe a lot of people vying for their attention. And uh, that's giving them that tower of saying, oh my God, what have I done? They feel whatever they did in the past, all the secrets they kept or whatever they did, it kind of all backfired on them because it's actually triggered the other person to, well, say, yeah, oh, it's all right, I'm not losing sleep over you. And uh, that's making this person now very nervous because they feel they've lost out. Yeah, on a four of wands. Look at this. Four of wands clarified by the four of wands. And who's feeling that? The person who's very in feeling very insecure. They feel very, very insecure that their offer will not be accepted now. They've lost out on the potential for a happily ever after. This person could actually be very, very depressed at the moment. Uh, four of swords, yep, because they're still up in their head. As much as they want to come out of this overthinking, they are still, they are still thinking <laughs> too much. Okay, so page of wands, because the other person is not really giving them that att attention, maybe not messaging them like before, maybe has blocked them out and said, you know what, I'm single, I'm abundant, I'm following my passions, look at me, look at me, I'm glowing right now and a lot of people must be giving this person attention and they are kind of feeling that this person is moving forward without them, is exhausted of them, tired of them, given up on them and is uh, going, la di da, I'm off, I'm taking a leap of faith in a new direction and and seeing that, I think, is 
making the other person feel devastated okay so ace of uh, pentacles in reverse spirit overall energy for capricorn's reading yeah see how i'm telling you this is this is what they are worried about this is the tower that they're going through huge tower that they've missed out on an opportunity and now it's not going to be accepted and the worry is that that person has sailed away without them and is moving towards new love they're very worried so that's what i have for you capricorn till next time then love and light take care namaste